Hello there and welcome to Complete Games with me James, I hope you guys are all doing well and I'm back with another channel update for the month of April 2020. We're going to start with looking back at the previous month, what we did analytic wise. First of all, we hit over 100,000 views in that month, we surpassed 2,287 likes, 238 dislikes, 209 comments and 670 new subscribers. So welcome everybody who's new and again uh, couldn't be happier we also managed to complete the first game on the channel and managed to get the island done finally also managed to put the bonus episode out completing it on gamma thanks everybody for all of the support on the series i really did enjoy making this managed to do it in under 30 videos and it has taken quite a while to do and uh, yeah we finally managed to complete a game on the channel Moving on, and I know a few of you would like to know when I'm going to do another live stream, and I did a test run yesterday. We went on Twitch, and if you'd like to follow me on Twitch, it's uh, James C Games at Twitch TV. And I just changed my old channel round and had a good good stream just to test how everything was working. I need to get my follower alerts and everything working again but it was really good to go back and uh, some of my old followers also popped in so it's really really great to see you and hang out with you guys again uh, you're a good laugh and I really do feel a lot more comfortable on Twitch being live and I feel like I want to keep my YouTube videos separate to my live stuff so I'm going to be doing quite a lot of live streaming over the next few weeks I would expect because we're all sort of confined at home and if you want to come and hang out, I know a lot of you are bored, so we're going to do some streaming over there. On the 10th of April, it's my birthday, so I'm definitely going to do a live stream for my birthday. Haven't decided what we can do, I've got a few ideas. I could potentially hook up the Nintendos or something really old, any of the old stuff. Any ideas down there at all what we should do for the birthday stream? Or we could do an interactive game or something. If you want, comments down below there. But yeah, come and hang out with us on Twitch. Again, if you're finding that you've got lots of time on your hands and you'd like to join the Complete Retreat server, you're more than welcome. And just join the Discord and we'll we'll add you to the group. And yeah, there's a few of us on there now. There's some nice builds coming along and it's good to, good to play it with some people. So if you are stuck and you're bored, so yeah, just join the Discord. And if you're not on PC, you're welcome to join the Discord anyway. Come for a chat. Like I say, I mean, we're, we're all stuck at home. We're bored out of our brains. And us gamers, well, I guess a lot of us are used to it. But, you know, it's a, it's, a, it's a hard time for everybody. So getting involved with a game just to occupy the time, you know, can be a good thing. So we're all in the same boat here. And you're welcome to come down. Even if you just want to drop into the chat if you're bored. Uh, moving on with the month of April. I know I did miss one Sunday out because of the ARC stuff. I had to skip Subnautica. Uh, I'm really enjoying playing Subnautica and I'm getting to the point where I'm going to have to build the Cyclops. That should be the next episode. We're going to have to, I'm going to have to do that at some point actually. It's not quite as popular as the ARC stuff. I know that most of you come here for the ARC stuff, but I am completing a variety of games, even though I do focus mainly on ARC. I've got to have a break and I'm loving playing Subnautica at the minute and I know I've got to build the Cyclops and I wanted to do it last week when I stream it when I was playing it I was like oh I've got to carry on and build the Cyclops but I'm just sticking it to Sundays so I had a few comments people ask will I be playing Below Zero and I've got it I streamed it on the first day of release I remember the developers bringing it out I've been a massive fan of this game since it's been a early access but until it has an end I don't intend to bring it to the channel, so until it's fully released and uh, I know what I'm doing and I can present it in a way where it's not a blind playthrough. I guess that's the kind of the way that I've, I've got to approach the games that I play. Once you've completed a game, going back to replay it and complete it can show a faster way to do it. So that's kind of how I approach doing these playthroughs really. And I'm going to have to complete Below Zero and then that's when we will potentially play Below Zero on the channel. And like I say, come and follow me down on Twitch TV if you want to see some live stuff and you're bored. This is, this is how I feel about live streaming. I feel when I do it on YouTube, sometimes I can live stream for six or seven hours straight. And I don't expect people to sit there and watch me for seven hours straight. but when it's uploaded to YouTube anything over four hours and it cuts the video out and 
it's kind of left there forever and I think if I'm going to put a live stream up it would be highlighted edits and you know people come in on Twitch they might be cleaning up the house they might be exercising might have something on in the background but they jump in and out of Twitch and that's kind of how it works I think it's the definitive platform I don't like doing the restream stuff where you multiply streaming to Mixer and Twitch and YouTube because somebody's commenting on YouTube and I don't see it on my Twitch chat and I'm missing out so to me the home of streaming the place that's got it right is Twitch I like the way that people can clip stuff in the chat it just the whole ecosystem and just the whole way it feels like I say I try not to use any offensive language but sometimes you feel when you're live streaming you know something might slip out and when you upload a video on YouTube there's so many rules now about what you've got to do and I feel that with Twitch it's different because I feel I'm more relaxed on Twitch YouTube I can't see the comments quite as well and it doesn't feel as interactive as me for the viewers so if you like live streaming and you want to come by and you're bored and I'm just on in the background rambling talking to my dog talking to myself I'll be there over the next few weeks don't hold me to put a schedule up because I just I'm just gonna go on when I feel like it I guess I just want to finish by saying everybody take care of yourselves and hopefully life starts getting back to normal a little bit sooner but if you're bored out of your brains well you know you know where i'll be <laughs> sat right here until next time i'm james from complete games and i'll see you